Okay, so now that you are paired to the app, uh, we'll go ahead and step through the install menu on it to set it up for the first time. All right, and as you go through, when you look at the upper left corner of your screen, you will sometimes see the information icon. So when you get to things where you maybe need a, a, like a configuration ID decoded, you can press that information button. It will bring up the decoder for your configuration IDs, and it will also bring up any other useful information depending on which page you're on or where that icon comes up. So when we hit the menu on the app, we'll tap on the install menu, and the first thing up is the date and time and you can choose to set the date and time to use your mobile device date and time just by turning that button on. And then you hit next. And then the uh, next option is an RTU name. You can tap on that and type in the RTU name. The model number will already be there from the factory. Serial number two, catalog number should be there as well. And when you've got those in, go ahead and hit next. The next thing up on the uh, install menu is your configuration IDs. There are two, configuration ID number one, configuration ID two, and these are where you choose the options for the unit. The configuration ID should also match the configuration ID label that comes on the control panel of the unit. You'll go ahead and hit next when you've got the configuration ID complete if you've added any changes or added any accessories. Next on there will be the dehumidification mode. So if it's a humidatrol unit, this should already be selected. If it's a non-humidatrol unit, then you'll be able to select enhanced dehumidification if you need it for that. Once you've made your selections for dehumidification, you'll press the next and then you choose your, your sensory input for your dehumidification mode, whether it's gonna be local sensor or a network sensor or a, or a digital input. And when you've selected that, you'll hit next and move on to the next thing where you will also choose your reheat set point and the dehumidification uh, dead band. After those are selected, uh, we'll move to the uh, uh, dehumidification, uh, the enhanced dehumidification menu to select or, or deactivate that. The next thing on the menu is a, a status or a summary of the selections that you've made in the setup. So you can review your selections and hit next and we get a second page of uh, the, the summary and then when you hit next on that time, you are done with it. You have a unit now that's set up and ready to roll. Thanks.